Hello viewers, welcome to my Microsoft Power BI learning session. In my previous tutorial, I showed you how to clean the data. For example, uh, how to remove column, how to remove blank rows, how to change data type, how to append uh, data and merge data into existing table in Power BI. So you can check out those tutorial too. In this tutorial, we will learn how to use different charts in Power BI. So let's start. First, I will show you clustered column chart. Here is my data and uh, these are the information in the data. This is the city categories. Here I have four categories here and the product here I have several categories. This is the total price sales let's create a simple clustered column chart for this first click on total cell this is the total cell uh, information i want to show it as country wise or city wise so i am check on this city now it's showing the city wise total sales information in case of product here uh, we see there is a lots of categories so if we drag and drop this into the legend we see it create a chart but it does not look so good i think so we can remove this let's create a category wise total cell information now it's look pretty good so here what we see here is uh, total cell information by categories so in in boston city we can say the cookies contribute more than other categories you can also add more information here suppose you want to show the information region wise so for this you have to drag and drop the region in x axis now you have drill down option and uh, before we do not have this option but when you drag and drop this uh, region you will find the drill down option after city we have the region information click on here you can see also the uh, region information now it shows the category wise sales information of all the cities that belongs to east region you can also add more information here go to the format visual you can change the color of the bar okay suppose in case of snacks you want this color click on this now the snacks category are turned into that color okay data label you can turn on the data label you can also change the background here also if you want this you can also add more information such as tool tips suppose you want to show the unit price so drag and drop it here now when you hover the mouse over here you will also notice there is a unit price that add on that notification this is our first clustered column chart in the summary you can say that it allows direct comparison of multiple series in vertical column here the vertical bars are grouped by the categories in my case these are the categories by bar cookies uh, crackers and snacks and we also say that if your data contains less than five categories then the graph or the chart looks pretty good when you use clustered column chart let's add stacked bar chart okay similarly being on total cell this is my total cell information i want this as city wise this time i will use stacked bar chart 100 percent now this is the 100 percent uh, information if you hover the mouse here it will show the information of total cell by cities let's add more categories now i will add product information here so i'm click on this product it shows the product information here we can say that in new year arrow row contribute more to the total sale than the others and in san diego here also the arrow road contribute more than the other product 
in term of total sale here percentage of total sale is 100 percent if you want to show the contribution of this product in percentage you can go to the format visual then data label click on turn on now you will see the percentage of the product that contribute in term of total sale within the city you can also uh, change the color from here bar you can from here you can change the color and uh, you can also change the title keep it bold and keep it in the center so that's it i hope you like this video and uh, you can consider subscribe to my channel thanks for watching